This next song is called Teach Me to Number My Days, O Lord. Let's teach me to number my days, O Lord. Coming from Psalms 90 and 12, Proverbs 27 and 1, Psalms 143 and 10, Mark 1 and 35, 1 Corinthians 4 and 2, Psalms 100 verse 5, Ephesians 5, 16 and 17, and Psalms 39 and 4. But we'll do our reading from Proverbs 27 and 1 and Psalms 90 and 12. Proverbs 27 and 1 says, Boast not yourself of tomorrow, for you know not what a day may bring forth. And then Psalms 90 and 12, and Psalm 90 and 12, uh, it says, Psalms 90 and 12, it says, So teach us to number our days that we may apply our heart unto wisdom. Um, and this day and, uh, and time and life, it seems that minutes roll into hours, hours into days, days into weeks, and weeks into months, so on and so forth. Time really is a vapor. And before we know it, uh, weeks are gone, months are gone. And we really have to uh, understand and know that we must value the time that God has given us. It reminds me some time ago in a dream, it seemed like I was in a garden. God was in the garden. I could only see his feet. So I was standing at his feet and we were talking and I don't remember what the conversation was about now. It was some time ago. Uh, but I remember that uh, the conversation was finished and I was walking, I was leaving the garden and I felt a beckoning to come back. So I returned and walked back to the edge of the garden and there was a big clock there. And on this clock, it had hands and the hands were moving really fast. And, uh, and then there was a little digital output on the clock. And I understood later that the, uh, that that clock represented my life. And that as fast, as long as those hands was moving fast, that my life was, was still moving here on earth. And I, I got it from the dream that God was going to show me when my time would end here on earth. I kind of felt that in the dream. And the hands began to slow up. And as the hand would begin to slow up, the, the digital thing was starting to, was about to appear. And, but right before it appeared, uh, someone woke me up. Some loud fell in the house and I woke up. <laughs> so I didn't get to see the date and time that it would be. But Hezekiah didn't like the date and time that he got either. He wanted more time when, he, when God told him his time was in. But the point is, is that we're here on this earth for a period. And we must make sure that we use the time wisely to take care of God's business first.
mercy to be treated. Lord, I dedicate the day to you. Live sensibly with your purpose. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. I will consider you and value each day, because you that give it, O oh Lord, may each day I live with you on, O oh Lord. Lord, I must take care of your business, why is still day? Night is coming when no one can work. I climb my ear to you to hear all of your word. Apply my heart to your knowledge, so teach me the number of your days. Your wisdom is half of gold. I'm standing more than silver, and without your knowledge, I will surely perish. Wisdom, you are my sister. Inside my intimate friend, give me truth, wisdom, instruction, and understanding. Teach me the number of my days. Teach me the number of my days. Oh Lord, my God, teach me the number of my days. We walk by faith and not by sight. So just simply, simply, simply believe. We walk by faith and not by sight. So just simply, simply, simply believe. Like a child receive, we must believe. And just simply, simply, simply believe. Don't you know who we serve? Don't you know who he is? He 